The Indian Union Muslim League IUML, commonly referred to as the League is a political party in India. It is recognized by the Election Commission of India as a state party in Kerala. IUML has an MLA in Tamil Nadu. History In December 1906, Nawab Vikar ul Malik founded a new party to protect the rights of Muslims called the All India Muslim League. In 1947, India and Pakistan became new countries. The All India Muslim League was succeeded by the Muslim League in Pakistan and the Indian Union Muslim League in India and the Awami League in the East Pakistan province of Pakistan. Now Bangladesh. The Indian Union Muslim League was formed in Madras on 10 March 1948. It has had a presence in Parliament from 1952 to the present day. In Kerala, it led the cabinet once under the late C.H. Muhammad Koya, who became the Chief Minister of Kerala in 1978. In an alliance with the Indian National Congress and other parties, the Muslim League has been an active member of the United Democratic Front. In Kerala, under the leadership of Syed Abdurahiman Bafaki Thangal, K. M. Sithi Sahib, Panakad PMSA Pukoya Thangal and Syed Muhammad Ali Shihab Thangal, it grew to be a major political player. Party members have held cabinet positions at various times in coalition governments in Kerala, holding portfolios like education, home, industries, public works, local administration, social welfare, fisheries etc. At the beginning of 1970s, IUML had ministers in West Bengal leading a contingent of seven MLAs in the State Assembly. The late A.K.A. Hassan Usaman was the League representative during the ministry of Ajoy Mukherjee. Apart from Kerala and West Bengal, IUML has had MLAs in Tamil Nadu, Pondicherry, Maharashtra, Karnataka, UP, and Assam and there were members on the Delhi Metropolitan Council and mayors in various municipal corporations in India. As a constituent of the United Progressive Alliance, IUML assisted UPA to muster the support of minorities and other backward communities and has held representation in the UPA government since 2004. E. Ahmed, who became the president of IUML following the death of GM Banatwala, was the Minister of State for External Affairs during 2004-2009. From April 2009 to January 2011, he was Minister of State for Railways. He again assumed the position of Minister of State for External Affairs on January 24, 2011. Ahmed also held the additional charge of the Ministry of Human Resource Development from July 2011 to October 2012. The party participated in the ouster of the First Communist Party of India CPI government in Kerala in 1959. In 1960, the party took part in the formation of a coalition government in the state, consisting of the Indian National Congress, Praja Socialist Party and IUML. The coalition government was short-lived. In the elections in Kerala in 1967, the party entered a united front coalition led by the Communist Party of India Marxist CPIM. The other members of the front were the Communist Party of India, the Revolutionary Socialist Party, the Karshaka Thojalali Party, Peasants and Workers Party, the Kerala Socialist Party and the Samyukta Socialist Party. Muslim League had two ministers in the state government of that front. In 1969 the party left the CPIM led government and participated in the formation of a new government led by Communist Party of India leader Achutha Menon as chief minister together with CPI RSP KSP and Kerala Congress After the 1970 elections Achutha Menon became elected chief minister for the second time Members of the governing coalition were the Indian National Congress IUML RSP and PSP the Menon government lasted until the downfall of the Indira Gandhi regime in 1977 no state elections were held in this period. In the chaos that followed, the IUML leader C. H. Muhammad Koya held the post of Chief Minister from 12 October 1979 to 1 December 1979. <laughs> Disintegration ahead of the 1980 elections While the two political fronts, the United Democratic Front and the Left Democratic Front took shape ahead of the 1980 elections, two different sections of IUML ended up in opposite camps. A breakaway faction, the All India Muslim League joined LDF and the Indian Union Muslim League joined UDF. 
The two groups reunited in 1985 under the name IUML and as member of UDF. In 1987 IUML left UDF for a period only to reunite later. Organizational structure The Muslim League is best among the Muslim organizations that maintains a consistent presence in the Indian parliament. The youth wing of IUML is called the Muslim Youth League and its students wing is called the Muslim Students Federation. The party also has a women's political wing. The Muslim Women's League. In Kerala, the party has a separate trade union organization, Swatantra Thojalali Union S. TU, Independent Workers Union, and a Peasants Union, Swathantra Karshaka Sangam Independent Peasants Union, Lawyers Forum for Advocates and KMCC for Expatriates of IUML Supporters. In Kerala, the party had five ministers in the recent UDF government. Prof. K. M. Kader Mohadeen is the national president of the party. One, apart from Kerala, the party also has some influence in Tamil Nadu where it is a member of the Democratic Progressive Alliance. In the Lok Sabha elections of 2004, the party won two parliamentary seats, Ia Hamid from Kerala and K. M. Kader Mohadeen from Tamil Nadu elected as a Dravida Munnetra Kazhagam candidate from Velour. In the 2009 elections, Mr. E. Ahmed Malapuram, Mr. E. T. Muhammad Bashir Panani, and M. Abdur Rahman Velour, Tamil Nadu won seats. Mr. E. Ahmed became the Minister of State for External Affairs. After the death of Panikkad Sayyid Muhammad Ali Shihab Thangal on 1 August 2009, his brother Panikkad Sayyid Hyderali Shihab Thangal was appointed as the President of the Kerala State Committee of the party. Composition Professor. K. M. Kader Mohadeen, P. K. Kunhalakuti MP and P. V. Abdul Wahab MP are the National President, Gen. Secretary and Treasurer respectively. Muslim Youth League The Muslim Youth League is the youth front of the Muslim League, commonly referred Youth League. It deals with issues related to the youth of India. The Youth League is one of the influential constituents of IUML. The President of the Indian Union Muslim Youth League is Mr. Sabir Ghaffar West Bengal. The General Secretary is C. K. Subair Kerala. <laughs> Muslim Student Federation The Muslim Students' Federation MSF is the student front of the Indian Union Muslim League. It has been working for more than 81 years organizing Muslim students along the lines of democratic, secular and progressive ideals. MSF attempts to mold the students in the Islamic way of life and providing them with the leadership qualities and skills to face the challenges of changing times. MSF upholds the vision of late Qaid Milith Muhammad Ismail Sahib, who masterminded the political movement of the minorities of India for their honourable existence. MSF prepares the students to carry on the mission of encouraging a vibrant community to participate in the nation-building activities. The national president of the MSF is T.P. Ashrafali, and the national general secretary S.H. Muhammad Arshad. After Kerala MSF also have strong hold in Tamil Nadu. Topic. Electoral history Topic Kerala The IUML has traditionally performed well in Kerala state elections. The following are the last ministers of the IUML in Kerala P. K. Kunhalakutti Industry, IT, W. A. K. F., Hajj Party in Lok Sabha P. K. Kunhalakutti Member of Parliament E. T. Muhammad Bashir Member of Parliament Party in Raja Sabha P. V. Abdul Wahab Member of Parliament Other positions E. T. Muhammad Bashir MP, Member of Central Wakaf Board and Member of Parliamentary Committee for Social Justice The IUML has had three representatives in the Raja Sabha from Kerala State. B. V. Abdullah Koya, he was one of the most reputed leaders in the IUML and a member of the Rajya Sabha for more than 30 years. P. V. Abdul Wahab MP Abdusamad Samadani, the Kerala Muslim Cultural Centre KMCC, is a global organisation of Muslims from the Indian state of Kerala. 
It was formed in 1968 by Indian expatriates who support the Indian Union Muslim League. Tamil Nadu IUML Tamil Nadu State President is Prof. K. M. Kader Mohadeen. He was a member of parliament representing the Velour constituency and is the national president. The State General Secretary is K. A. M. Muhammad Abubakar, MLA Kadayanalur constituency, Tamil Nadu. The State Treasurer was M. S. A. Shah Jahan. M. Abdul Rahman was an MP in the Lok Sabha. A. K. Thashrif Jahan is the newly appointed convener for the Women's League in Tamil Nadu. The party has advocate V. Jivagiridharan, a non-Muslim, as its state secretary, proving its secular credentials. In the 4th Lok Sabha, S. M. Muhammad Sharif was the MP from Ramanathapuram, Tamil Nadu. Fondly known as, Madurai Sharif Sahib, he was the first elected Muslim League MP from the state of Tamil Nadu in independent India. In the 5th Lok Sabha, he was again elected from Periyakulam, Tamil Nadu. IUML had Raja Sabha MPs from Tamil Nadu in the past. Ismail Sahib, 1952-58. AKA Samad, 1964-70, 1970-76. Kaja Mohadeen, 1968-74, 1974-80. AK Rafay, 1972-78, former Sabha members. KM Kader Moidin M. Abdul Rahman member of Legislative Assembly Tamil Nadu K. A. M. Muhammad Abubakar Other states In the 5th Lok Sabha, Chowdhury Abu Talib was elected from Murshidabad, West Bengal. Notable people N.A. Nelakunu